Hiya, and welcome to the end of week three. So I'll just do a very quick roundup, and it will be a very quick roundup because there's not really much to report, actually. It's been a really good week. I've been ultra consistent. My training has been spot on. I'm actually really enjoying my training at the moment. Usually when I don't have a particular goal in mind, I tend to struggle with my motivation, but um, I'm actually really enjoying my training at the moment. I've got, hopefully, if my trainer gets his act together, I'll actually have a new plan next week. So that'll be quite exciting. I'm going to start, I think I'm going to start playing with this because I've pretty much done everything. It doesn't matter what my body looks like to an extent now. So I'm actually going to start playing with this and use myself as an experiment. I haven't, I haven't experimented on myself for a long time. Usually it's in the form of diet experiments. Now I want to try some training experiments and the the one that I'm thinking of doing is back in the when was it I think it was back in the 70s there was this guy called Casey Viator and he was a, a Mr. America he did an experiment and in the space of 28 days he put on 28 kilograms of muscle which is absolutely staggering and everybody has basically tried to debunk it it's never been repeated and all sorts of it's all caused all sorts of controversy and stuff like that. So I thought that I'd have a play around with that one and just see if I followed the protocol exactly as was done in this experiment, whether I'd actually put on any muscle myself. So anyway, so I'm kind of looking forward to that. My, my trainer's got to adapt it a little bit to me and my daily routine. But uh, I think that'll be kind of fun. Apart from that, uh, everything has been absolutely bang on been super consistent with my diet which I'll get to in a second but um, I just thought I'd run through the photographs and you can see here I do appear to have come in a little bit in the middle again you see here yes it's sort of very soft and rounded here and here it's kind of gone a little bit flatter here before I get my little my little pooch which to me indicates that I've actually lost fat again through the middle. And I think you kind of see it. Look, I'm a bit bulgy there and I'm much flatter there. Do have a hint of abs. There's definitely a hint of abs this time around, which is really good. So that's awesome. And then that's not a particularly good photograph. But even despite the awful photograph, you can actually see my legs have come in. Look. Look at this. I didn't have it last time. And that was a much better photograph. So I've actually got I've actually got legs which is really cool. So I'm very happy with how I'm looking. And I actually feel this, again, this week, I haven't weighed myself. I've got no idea how much I weigh. But like, like I think I said this, this last week, don't judge yourself on what the scales say. The scales lie. You know, they go up and down all over the place, you know, every single day. And actually, I must, I must post this. Um, so I actually haven't weighed myself. I don't know what I weigh right now. But just looking at through my middle, this is what I gauge on. My middle's looking leaner. My legs are looking leaner. I've feel leaner, I feel lighter, my clothes, particularly, there's one particular pair of jeans that I'm borderline whether I can get into them or not, whether I have to go up to my, my fat jeans, and they feel a bit looser this week, so that's that's also good news. So I've, I've been gauging it by the feel of my clothes and just how I feel within my body, and I just feel lighter. I actually feel really good, so very happy with my progress. And then here's my compliance journal. So this week I had 33 meals and 29 of them were compliant. So I actually, what have I done here? Yeah, no, that's right. Yeah, 29 of them were compliant, which is 88%. Thursday night is my, as usual. I didn't actually go to South Melbourne markets, but Thursday night's my usual non-compliant night. So that's fine. Friday morning, I didn't train. So I went out for breakfast. Saturday afternoon, I had coffee and a cake. And then Sunday, I had a breakfast at a cafe post-training. So those were my non-compliant meals. So that's all good. Uh, and just a little a touch up on last week. We didn't have any fridge disasters this week, which was lovely. So um, look, really, really happy. My photo shoot is on Friday. So only five days. Oh my God. I'll do a check in next week, but that's pretty much it. We're virtually there at the end of four weeks of showing you how my uh, my my daily routine and my lifestyle has, or how I change my daily routine and and lifestyle or manage it to bring myself in for a photo shoot. So um, I'll do a summary next week after the photo shoot. 
and do a final roundup. A couple more things to post this week. I've got I've actually got quite a I think I've got three or four videos all ready to go. So um, lots lots to tell you still. But um, this week's roundup very short and sweet. And really happy with my progress. So I will talk to you in the next video. Okay, take care.